Kuradan Khan presents you a science and technology grade 5 lesson. Fungi specific learning outcomes. By the end of the substrand, the learner should be able to identify fungi in their locality, state the importance of fungi to human beings, state the precautions to take when handling fungi, appreciate the economic importance of fungi in the environment. New terms, precautions, these are measures taken in advance to prevent harm or danger. Importance, this is the usefulness, e.g. the usefulness of fungi. Fungi are living things. Fungi are neither plants nor animals. The singular form of fungi is fungus. They grow on plants or rotting things. Examples of fungi include mushrooms, yeast, bread mold, puff balls, toadstool, and many others. Identifying fungi in our locality. Examples of fungi include mushrooms, puff balls, toadstool, bread mold, lichens, yeast, etc. Activity 1. Observing molds on bread. Materials needed. A sizable piece of bread, soap, water, transparent glass bottle with a lid or a ziplock bag, a phone or a tablet. Procedure. 1. Sprinkle water on the slice of the bread. 2. Put the bread in the transparent glass bottle and seal. Or, if using the Ziploc bag, put the slice of bread in it then seal. Ensure that you remove all the air. Then 4. After 7 days, empty the transparent glass bottle or Ziploc bag. Wash the bottle with soap and water or if the Ziploc bag was used, discard it. The video which is playing is the activity which is to be conducted. So we are having a glass of bottle. Also we have a slice of bread. With us also we have a Ziploc bag. Also we have a sprayer. So we need to spray the water on the slice of bread. After spraying, we put the piece or slice of bread into this ziplock bag then seal it while sealing we ensure that no air is in the ziplock bag as well if you seeing the transparent glass bottle allow it for five to seven days observe and record your observations
after observing molds on the bread now we know that a mold is a black or green purchase on the slice of bread and also mold is a fungus that grows on decaying food like a decaying bread activity 2 identifying mushrooms and puffballs 1 take a nature walk around the school 2 identify and take photos of mushrooms and puffballs 3 collect mushrooms and puffballs 4 ensure you take the safety precautions 5 wash hands with soap and clean water after touching the fungi precautions fungi like toadstools are poisonous do not collect them do not collect this toadstool it is poisonous we were only to collect mushrooms and puffballs now we know that fungi are found in different places in the environment they are found growing in the soil and water fungi also grow on decaying food or rotting plants importance of fungi to human beings fungi are very important to human beings in the following ways one some fungi are used as food for example mushroom two some fungi are used in cooking process for example yeast yeast is used in baking to make dough rise and make it lighter three some fungi are used in making medicine four some fungi are used in processing processing of some beverages economic importance of fungi in the environment when we talk about economic importance those are the impacts which bring money to us one mushroom farming is carried out for food mushrooms are also sold in local markets and in other countries two yeast is used in baking bread and cakes that are sold in shops we can now see how yeast is used in baking stay tuned Safety precautions when handling fungi. Now we know that we should be careful when handling fungi. Two, there are fungi that are poisonous, like toadstools. We should only collect mushrooms with the guidance of an adult or the teacher. C or three, always wear protective wear such as safety gloves safety boots, safety goggles, and dust masks when handling fungi. Lastly, always wash your hands with soap and clean water after handling fungi. Thank you.
All the best from Kura Duncan.